Yo, what's up guys? This is your boy Bugs. And today guys, let me show you how to get more frames on off the grid. Now for my console people, y'all should be good. But if you are getting stutters and issues with your console, don't worry. Put your stuff in performance mode and y'all should be good. But for my PC players, I'm pretty sure most of y'all, 90% of y'all did this. But just in case you haven't done it, make sure you have your thing on window mode. It is way better than on full screen. Next, you want to have your frame rate to whatever your monitor is. Your resolution scaling, put that on DLS, DLSS or, you know, whatever your first... um resolution thing is um for your DSMO, put it on quality and then everything else is put low 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 off low 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 off make sure it's all low and if that's still not um helping like 90 percent of the community don't worry i'm gonna show you even how to lower your frames even lower than what the game shows you can so what you want to do in your pc is you want to type in saved games uh, once that pops out you want to hit on otg and then you want to um hit right click it and you want to edit uh, you want to make sure you it edits with a uh, notepad as you see i have mine so i just double click it and what you want to do is you want to low, or you just want to follow exactly what I do. And you want to just make all these values into zero. You want to leave your view distance because, you know, obviously you want to be able to see as far as possible. But you want to hit all these stuff into zeros. Yes, you're actually able to do this. And it helps with the um, performance of the game tremendously. The game frames still going to be really low, but it's actually going to feel smooth and actually somehow playable. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we all know that the performance of the game is really, really bad right now and we can't wait for that to get fixed. But until then, you could do these settings to make your game actually playable. Uh, you want to scroll down just a little bit and you want to hit three more things if I'm not mistaken. Oh, it's already low for me. But yeah, you also want to make these two um, at zero. And then that is pretty much it. Um, and all you want to do, oh wait, before that, uh, if you're still having issues, you can also lower the resolution even lower. I like to put it to 80 because I don't think you need all of it, but you still want the game to look decently playable. And after that, you just want to hit save. Um, the reason why you don't need to go and right click and go to properties and put on um, read only is because in case you have to change some settings um, when you start up the game, you don't have to come back all the way to um, save games and fix it all because... Um, if you do have it on read only, it will lock your uh, settings forever and you will literally have to go through here to change your settings. And I think no one wants to go through that. And after that, you just want to start your game back up. So the first thing you want to do is when you get into the game is you want to go to your settings and you want to look for your brightness. You're going to want to lower this thing down because I'm not going to lie. When you start the game, yo, it looks like a goddamn crystal ball. But yeah, we're going to start the game so you can see how smoother the game looks and thing. And I have a 2080 Ti. All right. And here we go, guys. You see the game is hella bright so i'm actually gonna lower my settings even lower than that all right so yeah so what you want to do is you just want to blow down your brightness as much as possible so the game isn't like shining back into you <laughs> save it and bam um like i said you're still gonna get low performances but right now i actually can see what's going on on my screen like look the game is actually running smooth i'm not jittering and stuttering as i was before and the game is actually awesome it's playable guys holy hell is crazy but yeah um let me know how it works for y'all um like i said this is uh more for people with like i guess lower graphics card if you have a 3070 plus and all that stuff um you should be fine or like these um settings actually won't help because i actually had a friend test it out for me he has a uh, 3070 and when he did this he said he still gets the same frames and it still feels exactly the same so it's more for the people that have lower um graphic cards and stuff um and yeah the game is actually enjoyable. Look, I can actually see the game isn't stuttering. This is crazy. But yeah, guys, that's it for the video. Leave a like if you like the video. Comment about anything you know. I love y'all comments. Um, comment if there's any way to um to increase the performance that you figured out that we still don't know about. And hit the subscribe button, guys, and I'm out. Peace.